Good morning, everybody. It's like, I don't know what the time is. Earlier than reasonable for waking up. Hang on, let's see. Okay, it's half past seven. It's not that unreasonable, but we've been awake for... I don't even know how long, but today we've got an exciting day. Isn't it exciting? Blah. Can't speak. A children's centre Christmas dinner to go to. Oh, my throat is still feeling like dying. It turns out I've got like half the symptoms for tonsillitis, but I am powering through because I can't be ill over Christmas. So at the moment we are just having a play. I just tried to get Magnus or Phil Magnus playing with this because he was being like super cute, like hitting on it and laughing away. And of course, the minute I get my camera out, he decides that he wants my phone instead. So yeah, that's just a life at the moment. I'm trying to get some really cute footage of him doing stuff, but it's hard because every time he sees my phone, he wants that instead of whatever he's doing. So he gets distracted. Yeah, you can come say hello again. You say hello, everybody. Oh, you could just look at me. That. Whoa, that is too close. Super close up of the baby. So, sorry, this is, uh, seems to be taken wow. over by Magnus a bit. If you've got some things you need to say, you. What else? Anything else important you got to say? <laughs> He's just got really distracted by some uh, dangling threads in my jumper. So, oh, oh God, excuse the mess in the back. Now. I really need to get some tidying done. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to leave it for here and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Uh-oh, you caught me. <laughs> that didn't last long. Hello. You do not get a like when we doing footage, do you? That is way too close. Here's one. Okay. Christmas jump mode is activated. I love it so much. I'm going to see if I can track down Magnus and show you his. Obviously, I have yet to do my hair or anything yet. It's only like 20 past 8, but I figure... Magnus might want to go down for sleep now, like soon, and he will either sleep for like half an hour or like two, three hours. So I want to be like as ready as possible before he goes to sleep because, yeah, just at the latest I'm going to have to wake him up at like half past 11 to get going. And he's just on my feet, so hang on a minute. There's my little Santa man. You show everyone your nice jumper. Can you take my hand? Can you stand up? You can hold on to here. I don't want to stand up now. You spent all your life wanting to stand up and now you don't want to. There we go. You want to stand up? Do you want to take my hand? Oh, no. Oh, we want to see your nice new jumper. Oh, whoever thought I could vlog with a nine month old? That didn't work, did it? Yeah, well, yeah, we get. Wee wee. There we go. How cute is that? I know you didn't get a proper look, and it's got like stuff on the back. It's so cute. You're adorable. It's like 12 to 18 months, and it's only a little bit big for him. You're getting too big, mister. Should keep you going nicely till Christmas, though, couldn't it? You use your world. My mummy loves you. Should we go have a nice play? See if we can tire you out a bit. I keep forgetting to mention I got this lovely package from Redbubble the other day. Um, I bought this with my own money. Like, I'm not sponsored for it or anything. But I thought I'd open it up and show you what it is. This is Tristan's Christmas present. Um, obviously, he doesn't watch my videos. You know you're great when your husband won't even watch them. Um, it's not really his sort of thing. He doesn't understand really why I like watching family vlogs. 
And you know what, people make this look so easy on camera, but it's really not. Hang on. It is a Monster Hunter hoodie. Um, it's really thick, really good quality. Um, I've never actually used Red Bubble before. I've never actually used Red Bubble before. Did you want to get on camera? But I've just heard so many amazing things about them. And they just do so much stuff. Like, you name the fandom and they've got stuff for it. I've been longing for something from them for, like, ages. But I thought I'd be nice and get dressed in something. Because apparently I wrecked his Linkin Park hoodie. So I owed him a new jumper. And, yeah, this was just really nice. And it smells like that new clothes smell. Oh, it's actually really nice. I don't actually like Monster Hunter, but he's like obsessed with it. So this will be good. I'm pretty sure he already knows what it is, but hey, I can't win everything. Someone has fallen in. Sorry, that's loud. Hang on. Someone has fallen asleep in the most awkward position ever. Like, my knees are like up and he's just led up against them but you can see his christmas jumper a bit better now and isn't it cute he has oh it's nine o'clock so he's got two and a half hours to nap so i think that should be fine because we want to leave here at about 12 ish i'm so excited it's not probably going to be the most slimming world friendly meal ever but I'm not going to let that bother me too much today. I'm just going to make sure I'm really good the next couple of days. I, had, I was quite good last night. I had a very strange dinner of like chicken noodles and broccoli. So that was pretty good. I had lots of broccoli in it. So yay. So yeah, I'm just having a, still attempting to catch up on my YouTube watching. Vlogmas really does make it go insane. Usually I'm all really behind because I don't watch, manage to watch it for days and then just have a complete binging session. But I'm just finding every day at the moment is kind of like that. So yeah, that's the plan for the next couple of hours and I will see you when this little man is awake. If we're not like rushing to go out. If we are then I'll see you when we leave. There's a cat. I love cats. Let's see if we can get a bit closer to it. Yeah, if you hadn't guessed, we are out. Let's see if we can see the cat. Look how pretty it is. Oh. Hello, kitty. Hello. No, it doesn't want to know. Look how pretty it is. Cats are like the best things ever. Okay. Bye bye, Mr. Cat. Poor Mrs. Cat. Not really sure which. So, if you hadn't guessed by the cat, we are outside. Yay, we finally left the house. It's always so stressful getting out of the house. It screams so much when I'm taking the pram down. And then when I come back and get him, and then he gets in the I'm like, oh, okay, we're going out. I get it. And then he's happy again. But um, yeah, we are just. Well, I say we're about to meet Susie. Uh, she hasn't seen any of my messages yet, but I know what sort of shop she's going to. So we're going to go on an Auntie Susie hunt. And I'm not, I don't know if we might just be going to the dinner together after that, or if we're going on separate ways and meeting up for dinner again. But either way, we're going to the Christmas dinner together, which will be nice. Um, yeah, I'm not sure what we're going to do if we can't find her, but. It's just nice being out, even if it's freezing cold. I hate the cold so much. So I will talk to you in a minute when hopefully we have found her. I found a Susie and she is joined by Spider-Man. And the sleeping baby, I'm guessing. Yes, yeah, so oh, he's not quite sleeping. Hello, and the Christmas pudding, who is awake, just being very quiet. And Magnus is... What's Magnus doing, apart from not being able to see? How are you doing? Here's Magnus. Mm. <coughs> so we are just hopping into Peacocks. We are on hunts for Christmas t-shirts. Um, just for Susie and Xander, I think. I'm going to pop into Primark. 
on Saturday and get one for the Christmas party, but I'm just gonna have to deal with what I've got on for today. So yeah, that is the plan for now. Words cannot describe how much I want these slippers. They are purple, they are fluffy, they are everything that is right with this world and I love them. And how cute are they? Oh my god, I'm actually in love with them. How much is the stripey one? Six pounds. You may have stripey pyjamas for Christmas Eve, okay? They've only got nine to twelve, so, like the biggest one. I don't know if that will fit you anymore. Why have you taken your hat off again? Those are cool. Yes, he's got very nice ears, but why are you not wearing your hat? You have to put it on when we leave the shop. High five? See if we do a high five. Oh, not quite. Can you show everyone how you can clap? That's not okay, okay. We'll put the camera away. Look how cute all the baby clothes are. They are just so adorable. My voice is just dying. So I want to get this one for Magnus. I want to get this for Magnus. I want to get everything for Magnus. He's just looking a bit amused. What's going on? So, just at Lander's head, that's the Christmas jumper he's wearing. So I don't think you've actually got to see it properly on him. And it's so cute. Hi. He's just chilling out. You want to say hi? No. Hang on. We are in Old Nixon. We're off to the Christmas dinner. We're just popping sand in the nursery. And then we'll be off. I'm so excited. I love a good Christmas dinner. Magnus is starting to get hungry as well, so he's probably excited, even though he doesn't know what's going on. We're all excited. It's just gonna be so Christmassy. Obviously, I'm probably not gonna get to film while we're in there because other children, blah, blah, blah. So I will let you know how it does, or how it went when we're done. So we are left the children's centre. We are left, well, that's a great English there. And we are about to go for a lovely fun trip to Asda. Not Asda, to Aldi. Um, Little. Yeah. Little. Whichever one of the supermarkets is, we're going there. Magnus is currently just chilling out in his pram. So, hello everybody. I think he's a bit tired. He had a great time though. He threw like 99% of his dinner on the floor and then ate my sprouts and parsnips. Um, he had his own parsnips and stuffing balls and then he like demolished a mince pie. <laughs> like I've never seen anyone eat a mince pie <coughs> so quickly and so happily in my life. So yeah, we're just gonna wander to Aldi or little a shop of some sort. So back in town it's just me and Magnus now and I can't remember if I've actually said what's um, wrong with me at the moment but um, I had the flu and I think that's I also have tonsillitis because like my throat is just in such pain all the time like my, yeah, my throat hurts my ears hurt even my nose hurts and I'm just really like I think the word tired let's just go with tired <laughs> like I know I'm like a mum but he's been sleeping pretty well recently so there's like no reason that I should be tired and these lights just went really weird but yeah <laughs> it's like I shouldn't be as tired as I have been the last couple of days <clears throat> so it might be doctors for me tomorrow I'm hoping it's not tonsillitis because I've never had it before and it sounds like terrifying like <laughs> the worst thing's ever really been wrong with me has been like the flu but anyway, yeah, I got into town. I went to Tesco. Then realised I actually have to get my grand out of birthday card. So now we're going all the way back into town. Good to card factory. It's his birthday on Friday. So I need to get it posted off like tomorrow. So hopefully it'll get there on Friday. If not, he won't mind too much if it's a day later. He loves me. Uh, yeah, and then I think we might just hang our wait for Tristan to get 
back from uni, I'm not really sure. He he's got his first bus, like his second bus home in like 20 minutes, and that takes like an hour. So I don't know. We'll see how things pan out, I guess. Snack break. We were just in Waterstones, and someone's looking very grumpy. So I just popped into Wilco's and got him some of these sweet corn ring crisp thingies um i got myself a drink as well because my throat is just like dying around me and then we're gonna go look at the christmas tree i saw it the other day in the daylight and it looked a bit rubbish to be completely honest so we're gonna go see what it looks like actually lit up uh, i don't know how long tristan's gonna be it's like half past four and i cannot remember when he said he got on the bus but he won't be too long and then I guess we'll just head home. Magnus and Tristan are having drinking Kiev tonight and I might just have a soup or something because ouch. So yeah, this is our tree. It does not look much better at night time. There's just so many gaps and it all just it all looks a bit chucked on. But that pretty much sums the town we live in up. Uh, if you're wondering what that sound is, we do however have a nice little fountain. But she's only been there for like a couple of months and it's quite pretty. Um, I don't think you might have drunk people that pee in it and stuff, but at least it looks nice. And someone didn't want to be in his pram anymore, so we're just wandering around having cuddles, aren't we? Uh, we're just waiting for Daddy to get back. He's nearly home, he won't be too much longer now. So Magnus is now having some well-earned milk after helping Daddy with the dishes. And I am so happy because I have had a song going through my head for like ages, a couple of weeks ago, and I couldn't figure out what it was. And it's kind of been like in the back of my head for like the past couple of weeks. And I just started singing it and I realized it's the Thunderbird theme tune. So that is like a whole weight off of my mind. So I thought I'd just come on and tell you that. I think we're going to have dinner soon. Tristan and Magnus are having chicken Kiev and curly fries, although I might force them to have some broccoli with it and maybe some frozen veg. We're going to get some vegetables in you. And I'm just going to have a vegetable soup because, yeah, I can't even face the thought of eating any of that right now. I'm probably going to be like slimmer of the year next week if all I'm going to be eating until my throat feels better is soup. <clears throat> Mm-hmm. <clears throat>